Theodor Zeras and here is another lick of the week. Today we will do tapping again and this will be the tapping number four, tapping part four lesson. Today we're going to talk about the minor pentatonic scale and how we can play this scale uh, while using the tapping technique. So let's go straight to the scale. The scale I will play today is the E minor pentatonic scale, E minor and I will play the 4th box I will start from the note E E is on the 7th fret of the A string and I will play E minor pentatonic E, G, A, B, D, E octave chord is E minor 7 again E minor pentatonic this is the sound of the E minor pentatonic this is the fourth box I think that this scale is very familiar to every guitar player now how can we play this scale with tapping and here is the answer. I'll come closer to the camera and the I will play the first two notes is the 7th fret and the 10th fret on the A string is E and G. Then on the next string we will play the 7th fret and the 9th. And we will not play this here but we will do tapping on the A string. So I will play the first two strings with pick and I will play the same thing with tapping. I will not play 7-9 on the D, I will play 12-14 on the same string, on the A string. So it's A string, hammer on, 7th fret, 10th fret with my 4th finger, with my tapping hand 12 and slides to 14. So again, okay, now we will move to the next string. The next string is 7 and 9 on the G string. So, I have to be very careful on, on with the hammer on, on the 7th fret. And then we have 7 and 9 on the G string. The notes after on the box are G and A on the B string, but I will play G and A on the G string, so it will be okay. Now I will sum up. Again, okay, and after we have. 7 and 10 frets on the top E string and then we have 12 and 15 I will do with the tapping hand so 7, 10, 12, 15 with tapping so now I will play all the strings together as you can see I am using only 3 strings the string A, G and E and I am applying string skipping so it's A string 7, 10, 12, 14. Then I will skip and I'll go to the G string and I will play 7, 9, 12, 14. And then on the top E string 7, 10, 12, 15. I will play all the notes together. I will say it again, you have to be very careful when you are doing the hammer on, hammer on from nowhere actually, because you play the note from nowhere. You have to do a very gentle movement in order to avoid the vibration of the other strings. So I'll play it again. And then I'll go back. E 
E minor pentatonic. Now I will put the metronome. The metronome is in 100 and I'll play eight notes, two notes per beat. Again. Now I'll play 16 notes, four notes per beat. I think that it sounds very cool. A lot of guitarists are using this technique. Like Michael Romeo of Symphony X, Greg Howe. I will put on my computer, on the Bad in the Box software, a E minor 7 chord. E minor 7 is the chord from the E minor pentatonic. 2, 3, 4. Faster now. I'll put the metronome on 120 and I'll play two notes per beat again. Two. One, two, three, four. Now I'll put the metronome back to 80 and I'll play 16 notes. Four notes per beat. Two. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Go. Three. Again. Okay, I will set again for one more time. Be careful with the hammer on. With this note. The slide I think is very easy. When you are used to the tapping technique, it would be uh, something not difficult to do it. Now I'll put the metronome on 120 and I'll play 16 notes. Two. One, two, three, go. Faster, 160. 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, go. Again. And 200. 200 BPM, 16 notes. 1, 2, 3, 4. Again. Again. Uh, as you can see, it's it's impossible to play E minor pentatonic with peak in that speed, 200 BPM, 60 notes. But with the tapping technique, it's very very easy and it sounds very very cool. I like it a lot. I'm doing a lot in my solos and in my songs and when I am um, improvise. So this is while using the tapping technique is a cool way to sound melodic and more interesting and of course to play your favorite minor pentatonic scale. Now I will put the back track and I will try to improvise over this thing that I just showed you. I will put the back track in 100. One, two, three, go. The same thing faster. So that was the leak of the week from Theodor Ziras. Until next time, bye bye.